In the UK, I think it's it's obviously good. We're we're a young team, um, and that's the the feedback we we kind of get when I'm over there. Um, and obviously, recently as well with the with the two results, Australia in November, um, and Wales the the season, well, the, the Six Nations before. I think. Um, it's exciting and I think a lot of people appreciate that um, and they can see obviously when we play, we play some exciting rugby and, um, you know, people people like to see that um, and that's kind of everything that, that we believe in and, and everything we kind of want to do is obviously feeding back through uh, and that's the kind of things that I get told, which is, which is obviously good for us, but um, yeah. Yeah, I've played there um, and it's, you know, it's a great atmosphere. Obviously, before the game, um, you know, there's the very famous uh, drink Guinness. So there's plenty of that being flown, uh, flown around. But um, yeah, it's, it's a great atmosphere. And I've never been as a fan, um, only, only as a player. But I know that the kind of the Irish fans are very keen, passionate, um, and, it, and it makes for a great game. Um, and there's something special um, when you go there. And there's something special about the kind of the atmosphere for Six Nations anyway. Um, with that on top as well, it makes for kind of, great rugby and, and, and showcase really but um, yeah that, that's that's my experience personal experience but unfortunately never been there as a fan um, yeah so I think the Italian food in general um, everyone loves it right it's, it's pizza and pasta it's very um, heavy carbohydrates but uh, before a game it's great um, I think um, you know people people find these restaurants uh, they're everywhere you know Italian restaurants uh, my family have got one in London um, so I tend to visit there quite a bit, um, but the, the Italian food in general, the perception is obviously uh, pizza, pasta, um, and it's, you know, there's different varieties, different kinds. And I love coming over here um, when we have the camps because there's always plenty of options and, and different varieties that I've never seen, um, which is amazing. Um, and obviously I quite like a, a, a carb diet. Italy is simply extraordinary. Um, there's so much history, culture. Um, when we do our games, obviously we're based in Rome for the Six Nations, but not only Six Nations, kind of November and summer as well, when we travel around, it's some amazing places. Um, and the one that will stand out for me is, is San Benedetto when we went uh, pre-World Cup uh, before. And, you know, it's, it's an amazing place. Um, I think the Italian people go on holiday there quite a bit, which makes sense. Um, but the, the coastline and, you know, especially when you visit Rome as well for the Six Nations, um, the, the history, the culture that surrounds it. I mean, you can be walking around, you know, a corner of a street and, and bump into an amazing kind of piece of architecture or culture that you didn't even know existed. And yeah, it's just there right in front of you. And th there's so much to, to learn and, and to kind of, you know, feast your eyes on as such um, in and around the city.